Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I just oh, I'm supposed to be that way, aren't I? I think that makes it easier for you to see, doesn't it? Hopefully it does. Just want to show you this. Right, I'll show you the other one first. Well, I, I suppose. Oh, she's had some new bedding, aren't you? Yay! Hello, your bobby? No. Right, we picked up two of these. Now, I'm not going to mess about with it because it's my daughter's. And they were that funny brown kind of looking wood. Now, they're not brilliant. They're only melamine. But I said to her, I says, what you do? Because she says, oh, she says, we'll have one each. I says, all right then. So she just painted hers white, used the original hardware and sprayed it black, which is perfectly fine. Um, she got hers finished. We got them yesterday, so we thought we said that we'd both start them yesterday, which we did. Hers was finished this morning. So that's hers. But I decided that I didn't just want to paint my... I, I should have filmed. I can't believe I didn't film it, actually. So, I take these off, like the... Um, when you get, like, the baby changing drawers... And it has all the high sides. I take them off and I keep them for things like this. I've chopped it in half so it wasn't so high. And I drilled and, grew, uh, drilled and glued and everything that on. And then I fancied doing a bit of a... Because it was just straight across. So I did a bit of a... Yeah, whatever you call it. A scroll or whatever with my jigsaw. And then I noticed I got, because I've like, had a bit of a clear out, so I got rid of a, tons and tons of stuff, filled two bins. But anyway, um, I'd got a few bits of wood, so I ripped it down with that doodah and that doodah. Sanded it all down, placed those on. Both my daughter and Ubby said, oh God, they're not going to look right if your drawers aren't level, because they're cheap, nasty drawers. It's all going to look harder and everything else. So I was like, look, I've got to learn. So I'm just practising. So that was that. They left me to it. Oh, my God. Let me just show you. Hang on, hang on. Where are they? I got... Ta -da! I got some of these. And these are the McAllister ones from... Our B and Q, these are absolutely fantastic. And all you do is lay your wood across, which angle you want, and just snip it. Now, as you know, I can measure fifty times and cut an angle, and it's never right. But with these, just show you. Look at these. Just about perfect. That tool is absolutely fantastic. So yes, if anyone can can get one, definitely. I saw a guy. Was it flipping drawers? He uses. He he was the one who showed me, and I thought, what a good idea. And it just glides through wood as though it's like an afternoon butter. But look how nice it makes them. I mean, mine are never like that, as you've seen. But anyway, enough with the close-up. We might be zooming in on a fault somewhere. Anyway, I went to my bigger being q that's about 40 minutes away from me. And they've got in a load of the Laura Ashley wallpapers. Well, I'm, t I'm really naughty. I, I always take quite a bit of a sample for little things like this. So this is actually a Laura Ashley wallpaper and all I did was just popped it inside. The biggest pain has been trying to find some of my handle hardware as such that goes with it to complement it as such. Now these things I normally take off and I throw away because I don't like them. I think they're dead ugly and old fashioned. But I'm flicking through and I'm like... It needs two, one either side, but I've not got two enough of anything. 
and then I spotted I'd got seven of these, not eight, seven. So I thought, well, I'll just put, held it up and I said to Ubi, what do you think? He says, yeah, it goes with the colour of the paper really nicely. It's like a, a brass effect. Oh, can't you tell I'm on my phone? This looks a lot better, doesn't it? Much better than my tablet, but anyway. So I've just put them on. It's about half eight at night. I'm absolutely knackered. My back's killing. And I've been doing this all day. Plus finish it. Oh, I haven't shown you those either. I'll do that. I'll film that tomorrow for a quick one. But anyway, I just thought I'd show you with, you know, a little scrap wood and a bit of scrap paper. You can turn something that's, don't get me wrong, hers will probably sell a lot quicker than mine because it's just plain. All her stuff's always just plain. She paints it and it flies out. But I just thought I wanted to add something a little bit different and I wanted to use that new tool for cutting wood. So, like I say, it went from that to that. So you'll have to let me know your thoughts in the uh, comments box below. If you liked it, please think about subscribing for all the people that aren't doing. And I'll see you in the next one. Okay, take care guys. Bye.